In a stunning wildlife incident, a three-meter-long crocodile was found lurking near the popular East Coast Park in Singapore. The National Parks Board and Parks captured and put down the reptile, sparking discussions about wildlife management in urban areas. NPAX, in a swift response to public safety concerns, captured the crocodile. Due to the potential risk that the crocodile could return to the same location, the decision was made to euthanize it. This decision was also influenced by the crocodile's size and the fact that the Sanjay Bulo Wetland Reserve, where a smaller crocodile was previously relocated, is no longer a suitable release site. In the wake of this incident, NPAX has issued an advisory to the public. Individuals are advised to stay calm and avoid approaching or provoking crocodiles. They are also urged to heed warning signs and advisory notices in areas where crocodiles have been sighted. This is particularly important considering that saltwater crocodiles, also known as estuarine crocodiles, primarily hunt at night and feed on fish in brackish and freshwater areas. The incident raises important questions about how urban areas like Singapore manage their wildlife populations. As cities continue to grow and encroach on natural habitats, encounters between humans and wildlife are likely to increase. It's crucial that urban planners and wildlife management teams work together to ensure the safety of both the public and the animal populations that live in these areas.